Okay, so today I'm actually out taking a little bit of a nature walk. If you're anything like me, one of the things that I notice that I wind up having to do is really think outside of the box. Of how am I going to go ahead and make sure that I capture the scenes that I need? Well, sometimes it just takes a little bit of uh, ingenuity to be able to do what you want to do. That being said, I've got a new product here for you today that uh, just might solve a couple of these problems. So we're going to take a look at that in just a second. In the meantime, enjoy the let's enjoy the walk together. There's several times that I've personally been out shooting and just feel that. I don't have an opportunity to really capture all of the footage that I would really need to. Part of that comes from just me really being the solo shooter. How can I be able to really get that BTS, that behind the scenes uh, footage that I need and still be able to get everything taken care of, you know, especially if you have clients uh, standing around. What I wound up doing was getting one of these. Now, I know it looks a little crazy, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull this out and you'll notice that it's actually a harness, a whole chest harness. The idea is that you go ahead, you put this on your chest and it allows you an opportunity. Of course, it does have the GoPro attachment um, as well as an attachment for any phone. So if you're a person who happens to have a phone or any other GoPro, you can actually just go ahead and clip that directly on there and it goes ahead and it works. Okay, so as you can see right here, I've got my harness on and everything is all snug and ready to go. Let's actually go ahead and take a look at it really quickly here. So I'm gonna spin the camera around so that you guys can see. Controls right there. Makes it very easy for you to be able to handle things the way that you would like to handle them. Now, of course, standing here with a 30 millimeter lens and I'm sitting that up on my camera here, I can still have my hands free and be able to shoot with this camera that's on my chest. There we go. And I can still go ahead and put my camera out here, pull that out, launch everything the way that I normally would, and I can do a little bit of tilting, perfect. And now I can actually record everything here while I'm actually going ahead and doing what I need to do. Let's just make sure that we're focusing. There we go. Yeah. when they show you a sign that says beware about it. Yeah, that's the one. It's mouth. You'll never hear those words coming out of Gerald's mouth. You'll never hear Gerald Bandon say something like that. Swampy Marsh. Now, you can see that when you have this harness on, you can see that when you have this harness on, ha, let's say that again. When you have this harness on, there's no real stabilization. So the stabilization... I feel like I'm very unprepared for this video. Stabilization is gonna come from whatever you're doing. So in this case right now, to make things as stable as possible, I'm going ahead and I'm actually having one hand on the chest harness and my arm outreached on the camera itself. Now the camera's got in-body stabilization. The lens does not. So we'll make the best that we can with it. Of course, you can also take the time to walk slower. <laughs> What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put that up on the screen. Um, you'll see a link right up there in the corner. It'll actually take you directly over to the product. If you like and enjoy this product, you'll be able to go ahead and pick it up right from my affiliate link.
If you like this or any other video I produced or just simply have any suggestions of things you would like to see me cover on the channel, feel free to leave a comment in the comment sections. And as always, thank you. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.